Pix 11's Christina Bear is live in the Upper West Side for us where football lovers are looking back fondly at Frank Gifford's great career. Christina. And Kaidi, the sports world truly losing a giant today in all sense of the word as football fans gathered here on the Upper West Side at Blondie's to take in the Hall of Fame game. They also remembered Frank Gifford and his legacy. He was a great guy, great announcer, and uh, greatly missed. You don't have to be a Giants fan to appreciate Frank Gifford's NFL career. And Frank Gifford is over for a touchdown. Gifford spent 12 years with the New York Giants. He was an eight-time pro bowler, former NFL MVP, and Hall of Famer, but his notoriety went beyond the gridiron. Hello again, everyone. I'm Frank Gifford, and welcome to Joe Robbie's Stadium. Mike Bako, a sports managing editor for the Daily National, says most fans might remember Gifford best as being part of one of the most famous broadcasting teams in sports history. Even though he was most well known for Monday Night Football, he did Olympics, he did Wide World of Sports, he broadcast Evil Knievel jumps. So this guy did it all. He saw it all. He was also known as Kathy Lee's better half, often appearing on several of her talk shows. He was never overshadowed by Kathy Lee. He had his own celebrity at the height of her fame. He was at the height of his fame. He was on Monday Night Football. Celebrities and athletes shared condolences and memories on social media after the family announced he died of natural causes at his home in Connecticut. Michael Strahan tweeted, RIP the great Frank Gifford, pioneer on and off the football field and a sad day for me. And then Kathy Lee herself saying, deeply grateful for your outpouring of grace. We are steadfast in our faith and finding comfort in knowing where Frank is. He carried himself well off the field, on the field. Great player, great broadcaster. So it's a big loss for the NFL. It's a big loss for the Giant family. It's a big loss for New York. And Giants owner John Mara also releasing a statement today calling him the ultimate giant in the face of a franchise for so many years. He was a week shy of his 85th birthday. We're reporting here live on the Upper West Side tonight. Christina Bear, Pix 11 News. Kaidi? Yeah, Christina, he will definitely be missed. I have